Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Merry Xmas to every one of you watching this video. I hope you guys had a beautiful Christmas because this video is coming two days or three days after Christmas. How was your Christmas? Let me know. So in this video, I'll be taking you guys along how I spend my 20 food and 20 feet. That's Did you how was it the experience and everything? Let me know the ideas so that next year I will know what to do. So let's just get right into the video. <laughs> What are you giving to? Yeah, Who do you want to give it to? Oh. Mm, thank you. My babies are ready. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> oh, thank you guys so much. Eh? I love you. Love you too. Look me getting ready. Let's go back. Let's go. Can we just all agree that there is no Christmas without ching ching? I am not one of those people that will do ching ching because each time I try to do it, it doesn't come out perfect. So I order mine. My stay law is my sharing block. What about you? How do you get your ching ching? Is it something you involve your children doing it? Because also I love it because it's a good activity. My husband was like, how will children know this Christmas without you doing ching ching? How was it while growing up? For me, really, we didn't do a lot of changing things, so I was, I'm not really used to it. What about you? Let me know your experience about changing and Christmas. My sister-in-law just sent this to me. This is what we'll be eating in the evening while watching the Christmas thing. Benny! Benny! I'm a girl. How much is money? Balling, balling. This is Mama after doing her Christmas hair. She was so happy. And Chelsea also, they did their hair at home and I really love the outcome. That was it. We are 100% ready. We have cooked. We have done our hair. So we are just waiting for the birthday boy to clock it. Okay, it's that time where the lady to unbox their gift. This is the gift. His first gift is the gift he was given in school. So I was like, okay, let me cheer and open your gift. These guys were not giving me peace. Mom, open our gift. We want to see. And normally, I am not the Santa Claus believer. My children, they all know I, I am Mama Santa. I am the giver of gifts. After eating popcorn, I was just like, okay, it's time to open your gift. Come and take yours. Come and take your own gift. 
Go and take it. Open your gift. Go and choose any gift here. Oh, go and choose. Yeah, what I knew. What's <laughs> that? Gas. This is for my father-in-law. Don't be so open like him. Open yours, King. This is your gift. To Tombu Ngala Itan. What is inside? What is inside? What is inside? What is inside? What is it? 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 You have two laptops. <laughs> the next day, which was the 25th of December, Merry Christmas! Get ready with me to dress for Christmas. Off camera, let me put It's time to take pictures and these are some of the pictures we took with my family, my children and I. They were so beautiful. At this point, I didn't look at the time. We were supposed to be in church at 10, but by the time we were leaving, it was 11.30. So I told my guy, okay, we can't get to church now because it was really late. Let's go and stroll before we go back home. So we didn't know exactly where we we're going to. We we'll just said, okay, let's drive towards the place. But when reaching at the place, we, we didn't actually want to get in because it's like it's a routine. We wanted something new. Was like, let's go to Bastos. So while driving to Bastos, we found this ice cream place, and guys, we had the fun over there. Watch with me to see how I enjoyed it. This place is called Coastal, yeah. And guys, I was so excited when I saw it in Yaoundé. I've seen a lot of people visiting it in Dwala. And immediately I saw it, I was like, this is the place we have to spend our Christmas. And there we go, we were asking him how to get in. So we went inside and the place is so, like, it's a small space, but very cool, nice, like, it's a place to take your children, your family. It was really calm, a good environment for us to spend our Christmas. Yeah. So we got in and 
I don't know about the price, anything. So I had to ask. You see, I'm taking the lead because my guy is kind of a reserved person. Not me. I'm all over the place. I'm like, that's me. So I asked them and for each person, it costs 2,500. So I ordered five. That was different flavors because at this point I wanted to try and know which one I will always go in for. Okay, that was it. That's how we spend our Christmas. We spend particular two hours, three hours there having fun, chatting, and that was it. I was happy because my children were so happy. Each Christmas, we always take the children out, go and play. At this point, I we didn't have anything planned apart from taking the children to church but as god has his way he brought us here and i'm so happy how did you spend your christmas what was the height of it for me was taking my children to this place i will not lie i was really excited so happy like a baby oh i love what this hair is giving the vibe is giving i am going it for it okay so this is it we were served and later we decided to visit the place. It has the supermarket called Spa, S P A R, which we didn't visit, but I promise to take you guys next time. So this was my daughter's first experience on this. Is it a lifter or I don't know? I don't, I don't know. I forgot to say she almost fell, and I laughed so hard. I was see see. <laughs> I see what's happening. But I was so afraid because she was carrying Lydia. And Lydia is, is my precious gift, my special baby. She will not fall. That's why I told her, you can't fall, but I just about my baby. So this is the place. It's really beautiful. It has a luxury there. So we saw just two shops and my guy was like, we haven't buy any shit here, sister. Let's go down. I was like, I have no problem in doing eye service, but he doesn't like eye service. So he said, we should go back. So we just turned immediately and that was it for the day. We headed over home. And after that, I directly went to visit my neighbor. Yeah, that's what I do every Christmas. I share with them what I have because I'm a Christian. I bring them lively things. Then inside is savon all, and that's how I spend my Christmas. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.